Hey loves, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a what is in my backpack video. You probably can't even see it. It is so huge. Um, and I have myself zoomed in. But yeah, so I am going to be doing a what's in my backpack video. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into this video. Before I start doing the video, I do want to say the giveaway. So, I am going to do the giveaway. It will be posted sometime next week. Um, when you guys will be seeing this, it will be probably August, August 7th, Friday. So, I may be posting it next Friday or next Saturday. Um, for the simple fact that my school starts that following Monday and I just wanted to do it around the time that I start school because I know some people are um, delayed in school and some people have already started and some people are about to start like me so I wanted to be in the medium the, medium, the middle um, and the middle would be kind of like whenever I go to school um, technically my the school district here like k through 12 they've delayed school until september but the colleges have not in my state so yeah um all of the rules and stuff will be in that video but make sure you're up to date and keep watching i am going to post a couple of videos before i do post the giveaway video but it is the title is going to be like um back to school supply shopping haul or whatever and then also give away at the end just to give you guys a heads up this is my first time doing the give a giveaway on my channel um so yeah i know you guys haven't met the goal but i still wanted to do a giveaway because it helps someone in need out so yeah the first thing i have in my backpack is actually out of my backpack because i just used it but it's this little makeup pouch my boyfriend's um little sisters gave this makeup pouch to me I think I want to say two years ago they gave it to me to me close to like when we first started dating so I just have a bunch of like emergency makeup in here I take this with me wherever I go um technically I haven't been taking it with me recently because you know I haven't been trying to wear makeup because of the recent events but when I do wear makeup for now since I have to wear a mask I wear just eyebrows and eyelashes but I put on, put on a full page I put on a full face the flat I put on a full face of makeup for the sake of this video obviously so yeah this is just like if I need to touch up makeup in the bathroom or whatever I sweat a lot so sometimes I without even without wearing a mask I sweat a lot so sometimes I did have to like go in the bathroom and just refresh my makeup so on the side of my backpack I just have my um, water bottle technically this is my blender bottle because I take a lot of protein do a lot of protein powder and stuff like that so I don't take a regular water bottle or a hydro flask I've been seeing those a lot in um, backpack was in my backpack videos but I don't have a hydro flask I have a blender bottle and yeah I work out a lot so I drink a lot of protein I drink a lot of water so yeah I just have my water bottle and this backpack you guys know I told you guys I'm just gonna use my backpack from last year so I'm going through like a cheetah phase obviously um I have a lot of cheetah print now but this backpack only has two compartments and then two side flaps for like water or anything so in the first compartment these are left over from last year but I'm still gonna show it because it's realistic might as well I haven't cleaned this out yet but I just have two pins three pins I love these pins they're the G2's and then these are just two random pins I have a ceasefire pin and a eyeglass pin some eyeglass place this is the lip gloss I was using last year. As you can tell, I finally finished it, so that has to go in the trash. And then I had a couple of um, granola bars in here. Um, they're a little squished, a lot squished because like they've been in here for a couple of months. 
gotta throw these away like I said this is realistic but if you haven't tried the Sunbelt bakery fudge dip chocolate chip granola bars try them they are good especially when you're hungry in the middle of class all right so that is it for this compartment we're gonna go straight into the bigger compartment I haven't bought any books for um, school like I said in my shopping video my back to school shopping video I only have three classes like face to face and um, those three classes are my fashion classes I am a fashion major so technically I'm not really gonna need books for those I mean we do have books but usually those are hands-on we might be like more inside the textbook since we don't really want to get up during class and we don't want to use the same sewing machine and stuff like that so we're probably not gonna probably gonna use the textbook a lot but the first thing I have in here are my headphones um, I lost the case to these because I've been home I haven't really had to use them use the case so I may need to get a new case before school starts because I don't want those to get broken. These are actually my third pair of Beats headphones and every time I get he Beats headphones I always break them. Last time I broke them like around this area and it was because I put them in my car. It was like on the side where the water bottle usually goes and I grabbed it from the one of the headphones and it broke so yeah the next thing I have is a mask don't worry whenever I get my actual mask that I wear to school this is not the one I'm gonna to wear to school but whenever I get the mask that I'm gonna to wear to school it's gonna have a pouch for it because it's not gonna just be sitting in my backpack don't want that to happen the next thing I got are my flashcards. Usually my flashcards are sitting on my desk like right here. But I'm going to start actually like taking these to school with me because just in case, you know, the teacher says something about um, just something I want to remember or something that's going to be on the test. I want to go ahead and write it down because my memory is not the best. So I want to go ahead and write it down. So I'm just going to bring all of my index cards with me. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this in my other back to school video, but I am trying to get um, a 4.0 or, or closer this year, this semester. So I really want to try to study better and just try to make it easy on myself, kind of, you know. So the next thing I have, you probably saw this in my other video, is the Happy Planner pen pouch. And I just have a couple of pins in here as well I am actually going to enjoy having a pen pouch because I've never had one um, and I feel like I'm not gonna lose my writing utensils this semester just because I have this the next thing you always see in a back-to-school video you gotta have it gotta have some gum um, I actually just started using gum at um, school I usually don't chew gum at all because I hate how people smack it so I noticed that it keeps me awake I guess it's like the mint in it it keeps me awake and it like ties over my stomach sometimes so that's a must I bet you guys can see all of this stuff filling up the next thing I have is my budget slash planner I have two planners this this semester and I really really love that so this one is just the one that I can keep at home or I can bring with me um, this has my budget in it so and as you guys can tell I've been labeling a lot of stuff um, I use the Dymo Electro tag because I also use it for my business and I just like how the labels look on stuff so this is how my budget slash planner looks and the first part is just a planner part and you can just write like things to do for the week this is not like a monthly planner this is just a weekly planner and it has like a lot of space in it and then it goes to the notes part so it's like a double a double um, thing and the notes part is just like paper that doesn't have the lines on it it just has dots and I love that 
paper that type of paper to write my budgets on so that's why I specifically wanted this to be a budget slash planner so for this month I just have all of the stuff I need to pay and everything the next couple of things I just have is two notebooks I bought these for I don't know why I bought these I mean I never know which one I'm going to use for which subject until the first after the first week because that's when I figure out like which one's going to be the hardest which one's going to need more paper um, which one I can keep home which one I can keep in my backpack so these two specifically I think I want to keep at home because just seeing these when I'm writing stuff down for my online classes is going to be like a good sign. I hope I got these in college rule. I have a small little pouch or opening right here so I'm just going to show you guys what I have in here. I have a couple of highlighters, some new lip gloss. If you want this gloss you can get it online on my store. It smells like coconut and mint mixed together. I love it. And then I have this white out because I make a lot of mistakes, especially whenever I use pen. And I've started to use pens a lot. I don't really like using um, pencil pens anymore. And then I just have this like little sharpener. And then in this back pouch, I just have a bunch of Crayola colored pencils. And then some fabric from fall 2019 because we did like an intro to sewing. I already knew how to sew but she just wanted to make sure that we could sew on the machines that were in the classroom. So she had us do like straight lines on some leftover fabric. <sighs> we're almost done. Okay. The next thing I have is my iPad. This is the newest one that just came out. It's the iPad iPad Pro 12.9 so I just have this little case on it and then I put an iPad an Apple sticker on the back and for school I don't have it yet I need to purchase it I only have a week until school starts and I have a lot of stuff that I need to buy and I just haven't got around to it but I'm going to change my case into a composition case it looks like a composition notebook but it just has like the front of the the book and then it opens and then it's my iPad so yeah this is just my iPad I'm going to take my iPad around with me to class for the simple fact that one it's lightweight than having a computer two I'm selling my computer three I don't know I just feel like it'll be easier than carrying um, my computer around Plus, I don't plan on like actually sitting down and doing homework somewhere like I used to do since the whole virus is going around. I would prefer not to, to be honest. And the last thing I have is my actual planner for the year. Um, I picked this up about two, three weeks ago and I love it. I didn't want like a glamorous one. This is pretty cute itself but I didn't want like a glamorous one this semester I just wanted something big because I like big planners and I wanted something with the tabs and I like how you can write I actually fill, filled out my personal information for this year too which is surprising but let me show you I like that on the big calendar you have like the side for a checklist for the month so this is April let me go to August I have I have some checklists right here that I need to do for the month and that's just like goals and stuff so I like that as well and then I have like I put all of my stuff in for the month onto here if you didn't know, August is my birthday month. So that is it for my What's in My Backpack video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to tune in next week for the giveaway. And just to see what you guys will be giving, what you guys will be getting in the giveaway. I'm going to be, it's going to be like a back to school 
haul so everything in the video is what I'll be giving one of you guys so that's it for this video I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy um, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in my next one bye guys